Hello everybody, I'm Christian Lamichka for Country Music News International and today on the show we have The, the trailer, trailer Choir Holla! So folks, uh, the last time we talked about your music and how you came to the music business and this time uh, we want to talk about, about your personality. Believe it or not, the guys are really smart. And the last book he wrote was... The last book I read was uh, a golf book on the golf swing. So when I, when I come over to uh, your side of the country, I can play some of those old courses. Okay, so here's the idea for all of you in Germany or Europe. Uh, send them a request when you want to play with him golf. So what's about you? Last book I read was uh, actually the Bible this morning before I left uh, my house. So. so you can go with him to church and <laughs> send your prayers that they get their next number one hit. That's right. So, by the way, we had a request from a female fan of you. They want to know what to do to get you for a date. Well, unfortunately, I'm left-handed now. So I'm off the dating scene. But if you were to get me for a date, definitely a great restaurant, a great wine, and laughter. What's about you? For me, you need mud bogs, big trucks and tires, cotton candy. Okay, that sounds like a major plan. <laughs> so, when you both guys have time off, how did you spend it? I enjoy spending my time going down to the children's youth group services here in Nashville and reading short stories to the young little toddlers and their little cookie crumb smiles and just to see him happy, just it just brings happiness to my those little tigers. I love them. And he's got his two sons now to carry with him down there, and they enjoy yeah. it too. I, I'm a proud father of two young little boys, and so when we're not performing or out on the road or playing golf or reading the Bible, I enjoy just being a dad. So you're working. It sounds like a plan that you're working on uh, to be on tour with four. Yes, well, you never know how it goes, but right now it's just the two of us and, uh, you know, but we, we would love to think that in our tours and our travels that our families can all come with us and, you know, uh, enjoy the road with us and that, that makes it even more special. I know we have to talk about the music too, of course, guys and friends and fans of Country Music News International, um, these guys have amazing music out. We would like to tell you what it is. Uh, our brand new song that's going to be coming out is called Ice Cold Summer. It's just, you know, it's a good time, good tune. You know, it's one of those things that's going to stay stuck in your head. But, you know, we like to have fun. You know, our music is all about, if you've been having a bad day, come take a three and a half minute vacation with us. You know, that's, that's really what we do. So, and, and we're doing a remake of uh, 99 Luff Balloons you, this year as well. You're kidding. No, we are. 99, 99. Luff Balloons. Yeah. Let me hear. 99 said Luff Balloons. No, maybe not, maybe not. Oh, okay. Boom boom. My goodness. Really close to the original. Yeah. Sorry. We we do love the song though. Hey Nina, if you're watching Country Music News International, this guy's would be fun for your next tour. We need to do a crossroads. Her name's Nina, right? Yes. We need to do a crossroads with Trailer Choir and Nina for CMT. Oh yeah, that would be fine. That would be fun, definitely. Yes. So I'm thinking about do you have an idea how old Nina now is? Uh, she's probably in her late, late 40s, I'd say. Uh, yep, yep. That's a really smart answer. <laughs> so, um, Nina, they are definitely something for you. They yes. makes you younger than you are. But that's good. So, what can we expect to see from you both guys in the future? Well, continued uh, uh, love and uh, trying for music and building our career. Um, we just love bringing happiness and good times to the music business. Everybody has their own way of presenting music and singing, and ours is a, ours is a backyard barbecue in high definition. Yeah, I think what he, you know what he said. We, we want to be out there on the road playing every fair festival in this country and every country that we can go to. Anywhere that I have us, we want to go play. Someone told me one of you likes stage diving. Uh, I've been a stage diver. I used to dive into the drum kit. Uh, I've 
I used to. I say this used to because I just, I, you just can't do it anymore. I just can't. I, I just can't. I can't afford the injuries anymore. <laughs> and, and a new drum set every week. <laughs> now, what what do they call rednecks in Germany? Um, we definitely have no explanation for redneck <laughs> because if you would call it, I know what it calls here. So um, <laughs> see, that's why Gretchen didn't have a big hit in Germany if you have redneck woman. Right. That's right. So, but anyway. Um, but now y'all do like beer, right? Yeah. So ice cold summer. Beer drinking, that would probably go over pretty good yes, there. Yes, that would yes. be fine. I'm just yes. saying. So, if you want these guys for your show in Germany, or for a party, or a private event, the best way, what you can do is go to... You can go to our Facebook, of course, but you can also go to TrailerQuireMusic.com. It has all of our contacts. It has a link to all of our uh, social medias on there, so you can find everything at TrailerQuireMusic.com. Or you stay here on Country Music News International where we keep you up to date what's going on with them. And also, we can give you his phone number. That's right. It's 8675309. Okay, folks. The in there. <laughs> so you know the phone number now. Have a good one here from Nashville, Tennessee. See you next time. Have a good one.